Good morning children. Welcome back to our online classes by Little Scholars Public School. This is Shilpa Patil here. Children, today we are going to start our 6th chapter, The Clothes We Wear. From this chapter, you will learn about why do we wear clothes, different types of clothes worn in India and how cloth is made. Let us start. Here, one of the example has been given. Mona has a collection of dolls and you have to identify names of dresses of these dolls. Okay. So children, now we are going to see about why do we wear clothes. Did you know why do we wear clothes? Yes. Clothes cover our body and give us protection protection from atmosphere also protection from heat cold and rain that way people wear different kinds of clothes according to their age gender and also region where they come from people also wear Dresses according to fashion, season and occasion. We wear clothes to cover our body. That way, different types of clothes we wear to protect ourselves. Different region people wear different kinds of clothes. Like this, here you can see, girls wear Different kinds of clothes like the skirt, shirt, shirt pants, trousers, kurtis and sari also. Men also coat pant, trouser, white pant, formal shirts likewise. Means according to their choice and according to their region, age and gender people wear different kinds of clothes besides that people also wear dresses according to fashion here you can see different types of clothes worn by women like that according to season also our dressing style changed means in winter we wear warm clothes in summer we likes to wear cotton clothes that way, according to season also, we wear the clothes. According to occasion also, like the marriages are there, party wears are there. That way, different kinds of clothes according to occasion. Jo bhi festival hota hai, ya fir shadiyan hoti hai, usme alag alag tarah ke kapde pehne jate hai. We feel comfortable in Loose and airy cotton clothes. We wear nylon, silk clothes also. The tailor stitches our clothes in different designs and styles. Basically, children or many of the people likes to wear loose and airy cotton clothes which feels very comfortable to our body. Also, like this like the age and gender as we have seen girls wearing frocks and boys wearing trousers and pants t-shirts likewise nylon and silk clothes also we wear according to occasion like this designer clothes also we likes to wear the tailor stitches our clothes in different designs and styles. As like our choice, tailor stitches likewise. Now we are going to see about the types of clothes. There are many kinds of clothes. Now we are going to see about it. First of all, sari. A sari is a traditional dress of Indian women 
It is a long unstitched cloth made from cotton, silk and synthetic fibers. It may simple, plain or embroidered with silk and golden thread. It is wrapped and wrapped in different ways in different states. There are different kinds of sarees available like the traditional. This is a traditional saree. The dress of Indian women is saree. In that also you can see cotton sarees also are there. Silk sarees also are there. And synthetic sarees also are available. It is according to our choice. And our occasions whatever there. According to that, we likes to wear the saris. In that also, long stitched cloth it is. And many saris are simple also. Embroidered also. And available in different colors and fabric. Silk saris also. And which worked golden thread. According to different states, different kind of saris women likes to wear. It is wrapped and wrapped in different styles. Like in Maharashtra, we wear Nawari sari, Bengali sari is like this and Andhra Pradesh saris are like this. That way, Kolkata, Bengal, uh, different kinds of saris or the style of wearing the sari is different one. Dupatta. Now we are going to see what is Dupatta. It is an unstitched cloth wrapped over dress like salwar kameez. It is also called chunri or chunni or odni. The Dupatta may be plain or decorated with embroidery mirror like this. Dupatta, which mostly used on salwar kameez or ghagra choli. It is also called chunni, chunari or odni. Dupatta may be plain like this or it is decorated with embroidery work or the mirror work. That also according to the dressing style. Now we are going to see about the dhoti. Dhoti is a white unstitched cloth worn by men in our country. We can see men in states like Uttar Pradesh, West Bengal, Maharashtra and Gujarat wearing white dhotis. That way here you can see white dhotis like this wrapped and back side of the dhoti. Here the Maharashtra dhoti like this. Different kinds of states wear different kinds of dhotis like the West Bengal. This is the Gujarat dhoti. Gujarati dhoti. Like this. West Bengal. In Andhra Pradesh also different kinds of dhotis men wear. Now we are going to see about the lungi. In South India, men wear color dhoti called lungi. In Kerala, both men and women wear a white lungi called mundu. This is the colored dhoti which is called lungi. Like this. It is in South India. And in Kerala, the white dhoti worn by men also and women also, which is called mundu in Kerala. Turban. Turban is a long unstitched cloth worn by, worn as a headgear by Indian men. They come in different colors. People in different states wear turban in different styles. Turban like this. 
This is the Rajasthani turban, Gujarati turban and this is Punjabi turban. In different states, wearing a turban in different styles. It is a long unstitched cloth. Now, shawls. A shawl is an unstitched cloth which is wrap ourselves in winter. Shawls usually come in embroidery work like this. Plain also shawls are available and embroidered also are available. Shawls are unstitched cloth which we can wrap especially in winter season. Basically shawls usually come with embroidery work like this. Especially in winter we wrapped this shawl to protect ourselves from cold like this. I hope all of you understand this children. Thank you very much for watching it.